Okay, so in this video, I'm just going to quickly show you how to apply a texture to a terrain and also how to deal with uh, those situations when sometimes you get quite a shiny texture um, or it looks like there's a bit of a halo around some of the terrain. So um, here we have an untextured terrain and what we're going to do is, well actually you can first of all you can see down in my assets I have a, uh, a whole lot of different uh, surface textures and they're just default surface textures as part of the standard asset pack which I've downloaded from the asset store. Now uh, what I do is I just select the terrain and then over here in the inspector you can see we have the paintbrush here and that is for painting a texture on. Now right now I have no terrain textures defined so I just click on edit textures add texture and then in this menu that pops up what I'm going to do is just click on select and we're just going to scroll through and find the one I want so I'm just going to go looking for grass hill oh, right there. there it is there and um, once you've got that I tend to change the size down to something a little bit lower so a one or a two um, that's just how many the, the size of it on the actual terrain and if you have it too big um, the texture can often end up looking a bit blurry but you just play around with that until you get it working for uh, your particular uh, terrain texture. So now I'll just click on add and if we zoom in you can see we now have this texture on here. However, if we pull out a bit you'll notice it's actually pretty shiny. It's getting this funny halo effect um, and if we play the game when we walk around you can see that we have a lot of glare so what we need to do is remove that and the way to do it is in your um, project folder down here is come and look and find where that particular texture is so there's my grass hill albedo there and then in the inspector you'll see something called alpha source just change the input there from the texture alpha just change it to none and then down the bottom click apply and that should remove any glare and halos. So now when we play you can see it looks a lot more natural. So um, that is a very quick overview over how to terrain, uh, put that base terrain texture on and how to remove the glare.